Taking a look at Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia that anybody can edit. This is the English version, has just over two and a quarter million articles uh, since 2001 when Wikipedia was launched. Uh, we can see uh, the introduction, there's the sandbox, and we're just going to have a quick look at an article here and make a quick change just to show how easy it is to make even an entirely anonymous edit. Just a small grammatical change here. And we'll click save and it'll show up in the main article. We'll see Wikiscanner in a minute, which takes anonymous edits such as this and ties the IP address, the computer's address that made the edit, to the company that did it. So here we are, we can see Tulsa Church, FBI, ExxonMobil, Disney, uh, Al Jazeera, and, and hundreds more on this page. We'll take a quick look at this, this one about the Armenian genocide. This is a change that's been made from within the Turkish Treasury. Uh, and so we can see on the left here is a paragraph about the Armenian Genocide. This has been entirely removed in this edit. But we can see that the current article we'll take a look at does actually have that in it. So that's been rolled back as a change. Here's the discussion page for that article where we can see the discussion that goes on around these changes being made. It's clearly very contentious, but there's a lot of context provided by this. Going back to Wikiscanner now, we'll have a look at this piece about Al Jazeera uh, making some changes to the Israel page. Uh, we can see a paragraph that's been prepended to the article here talking about the Israel-Palestine issues. Uh, and this is the current state of the article. Obviously that uh, has been removed now and the article has been semi-protected. What this means is that the article can only be edited by a user who's been a member of Wikipedia for at least four days. Uh, there's several levels of protection, ranging from full protection, where no one except administrators can edit, right down to none at all, where an anonymous can use, user can change things. Important to note that those edits are decided by a committee. You can see the frustration here on the United States page that the Israel page has been locked down. Um, it's not an automated process at all. Here's the edit history for that Israel page, so you can see why they have needed to protect it and the talk page here for Israel as well, as they note, heated debate. Just going back to have a look at a corporate lobbyist here, this is Walmart coming on, and they've changed some details about their pay. Uh, it's not 20% less than other retail stores, it's almost double the federal minimum wage. Uh, and there's the criticism section behind that article, shows more context.